Faith Hill and Tim McGraw's private island in the Bahamas lists for $35 million. Pack a swimsuit, fire up the seaplane, and you could be on your own stunning piece of paradise in no time. When country music power couple Faith Hill and Tim McGraw went looking for a slice of paradise to chill on in 2003, they found it in the heart of the Eczema Island chain in the Bahamas. At the time, La Ile de Angis, or Angels Island, was a 20-acre chunk of uninhabited and undeveloped rock. Nine long years later, they had transformed it into a laid-back, easy-going family escape. The best place in the world is how the duo describes the island. Every time we land the plane and walk onto the beach up to the house, we turn to each other and say, this is the best place in the world. McGraw told Architectural Digest for a 2017 cover story. Now, 17 years after snapping up La Ile de Angis, the two have decided to sell, listing it with a $35 million asking price. The 6,500 square foot main house sits high in the center of the island, just steps from sandy beaches on either side. It comprises eight separate pavilions, each connected by a series of breezy, open-air tiled walkways. Designed by Tennessee-based architects Bobby McAlpine and partner Greg Tankersley, the pair created a home designed for indoor-outdoor living. As Hill told Architectural Digest, we wanted to feel connected to the outside. When the breeze comes through the room, it's just life-changing. It's something for the soul. Architecturally, that means full side-to-side -side opening glass windows in each of the four bedrooms and a massive full-width glass paneled roll-up door in the main living area, with jaw-dropping views across the pool to the sea. The tucked away primary suite opens to the elements on two sides and features soaring ceilings with dramatic cross-hatched beams. A huge private patio comes with its own outdoor soaking tub. For outdoor fun, the island features 1.3 miles of ocean frontage perfect for kayak or snorkeling adventures. While a private dock accommodates a few fishing boats and jet skis. Want to look for Pirates of the Caribbean? The home's Moroccan-style observation bell tower provides 360-degree views. Because La Ile de Angis has to be totally self-sufficient, the northern end of the island is dedicated to generators and water desalination facilities. They're serviced by a small staff who live on the island full-time in three stylish cottages, fuel and provisions come in by barge. Of course, if you run out of Dom Perignon on any given visit, you could try calling your neighbor, magician David Copperfield, who owns Musha Key, a quick speedboat right away. As for getting to La Ile de Angis, also known less glamorously as Goat Key, its 90-minute flight from Miami to Eczema International or a 60-minute seaplane ride from Nassau. 